No what? visible reaction I to the K-14 compound. Today. We'll start the next trial, then. The dosage will be much larger this time, and the side effects will likely be more pronounced. Will there be any pain? I honestly don't know. I suppose it's your job to find out. Now hold still. There. All done. You can return to your duties. And remember to record every symptom you experience in detail. I hope I'll prove a useful test subject for you, Doctor. Mm-hmm. Hey. All this advanced technology, and we still can't cure the common cold. It's an honor to have you here, ma'am. Hmm. Advanced systems. This place is huge. Ah! I was not expecting a load door. I guess that goes kind of in... She's been at it for over two hours. What is she even testing? Nothing. At this point, she's just doing it for fun. <laughs> Fair enough. Excuse me. Oh, for goodness sake, I can't find my notes anywhere. Fine. <clears throat> I used to well, work exclusively on this. That was projects, productive. But lately, I prefer less animated pursuits. If you ask me, we're only scratching the surface with the latest synths. Excuse me, Doctor. Hmm? Oh, hi there. Sorry if I seem distracted. I memorized five sets of design schematics and now I'm doing detailed mental comparisons. What schematics? What kinds of blueprints? Mostly components for a new plasma pistol concept I've been toying with. High energy weapons are sort of a hobby of mine. Anyway, I'm glad you're here. I just wanted to say how much I admire Father. And that it's an honor to meet you. I really hope you'll stay here with us. I mean, there's nothing yeah. really stopping you from going outside, right? In case right? anyone didn't mention it, quiet time runs from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. Sounds reasonable. Hi, Doc. Eight hours. Since you're new here, you should take time to learn our safety procedures. And the sooner the better. Rules create order, and order promotes efficiency. Hmm. How, many, How rules? many rules are we talking about here? <laughs> Not nearly enough, if you ask me. I had some handbooks made up, but that was years ago. I'll see about getting one to you. Hmm. Uh, how big is this handbook? Just a few thousand pages, but I like to think it's a brisk read. I certainly find it so. Take care, then. <laughs> what? What's this? Oh, apparently it's just, it just blocks. Oops. Knocked it on the floor. Hmm. Really? Synth relay grenade. Really? What do those do? It doesn't say. Looks like a, an EMP grenade. Sleep is such a waste of time. I'd rather be designing more efficient plasma emitters. Safety first. Remember that. I, I have a feeling we're going to be exploring this for a while if you haven't figured that out yet. Operating at full capacity. What? Is there a hel is there an armor that goes with that helmet? If so, I want it. I need it. All this advanced technology, and we still can't cure the common cold. Hey. Welcome to the institute, ma'am. Yeah, about your outfit. Yeah. Status. Totally not wearing one myself. Sir. Authorized personnel only. So Dr. Ayo thinks he can hide in his office, does he? Well, you can tell him that I intend to speak to Father about these unannounced security sweeps of yours. Ransacking my quarters in the middle of the night is totally unacceptable. I'll pass along your message, Doctor. See that you do. Carry on, Hey, Doc. Welcome. Welcome. It is so good to meet you. I truly hope you'll come to think of the Institute as your home. What, what do, you do you do here? Oh, I'm in charge of housing and provisions. 
It's my mission to ensure that everyone lives a comfortable and productive life. You should know that many of us consider it a great honor to have you here. Really? Dr. Oberly. People on the surface have got it pretty bad. Makes me thankful for being down here. Nothing else to say, huh? Hi. Subject identified. I didn't Glad let you, you continue. To knock some heads together. What now? They're dragging Report their anything suspicious to the SRB. Maybe I should take some courses with me. You know, send a message. Mm. Please don't. There's enough friction as it is between us and pretty much all the other departments. Oops. Going soft on me, Alana? My methods get results, and they will this time as well. You'll see. Sounds like a mistake to me. Hey. Father's a great man. You must be very proud. I find it acceptable, you know. Quite quite acceptable, I guess. Uh, Black Institute lab coat. Worcester uniform. Which I already have, of course. You wouldn't happen to have a spare polarizer on you, would you? Oh, dude. Courses on the hunt are relentless. If you see one, you should stay out of its way. Doc? So, here you are. Here I am. Mr. acting director of the Synth Retention Bureau. I'll be up front with you. We're going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near future. Expected. Despite your relation to father, you're a bit of an unknown quantity. Agreed. I'm sure you understand. There won't be any issues, will there? No. no problems here. Good to hear. Now, Father has asked that I provide you with a brief overview of the Synth Retention Bureau. Our primary responsibility is the recovery of escaped synths that are hiding among the human population on the surface. Why would synths want to escape? Synths do not want. They might look like human beings, but they're machines. As to why they're escaping? That matter is currently under investigation. Our main instrument is the Courser, a third-generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Coursers hunt down and reclaim synths that have escaped the Institute. They are highly self-sufficient, trained in combat, infiltration, and tracking. In a word, our Coursers are relentless. Well, I gather you know all this, since you've encountered one already. In fact, I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. I'm no stranger to combat. Even so, a courser should be more than a match for any single combatant. I suppose I'll have to ask robotics to perform detailed diagnostics on the entire production run. As if we don't have enough problems. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. <clears throat> you mentioned that coursers undergo special training. Tell me more about it. The SRB constantly monitors our Gen 3 synth population looking for specific traits. Those who show tenacity, fearlessness, and independence undergo a rigorous training regimen. We teach them armed and unarmed combat, investigative techniques, psychology, and mechanical skills. Those who pass a final evaluation become coursers. The rest have their memories wiped and return to their former duties. Hmm. Seems fair. As you can tell, I don't care about uh, be robotic vigilant. rights, really. They they just many don't mean much like to me. Like any machine, a synth can malfunction. Just wish it didn't happen so often. Y you clearly haven't seen real machines. They malfunction all the time. Excuse me. I should really stop pulling out my shotgun in here. Just my gun in general. All systems nominal. I still want it. Robotics. Remember to keep unnecessary power consumption to a minimum. Don't recharge unless your primary levels are below 2%. Also, if you haven't patched your navigation software, do so after this meeting. The last thing we need is more synths bumping into walls. All right, that's all for now. You can resume your duties. Remember, health and happiness go hand in hand. I fix one relay and two more start to fail. At least I'm not bored. All maintenance Excuse requests me, should doctor. be directed to it's the facilities division. It's a real juggling division. act, trying to keep all the systems down here operating in the green. This place might look shiny and new, 
but there's a lot of old technology in these walls. I lose sleep worrying about when the next blackout's gonna hit. So basically this place is a sham. Great. Ah, uh, I wouldn't say that. I mean, even the older tech has held up for decades. Some even for centuries. It's pretty amazing when you think about it. Our ancestors built things to last. Of course. That's true in real life, too. Before they blew up everything in the war. Now that there's some stuff I need to check on. See you around, yeah? Okay. Robotics. No, seriously, old hardware? Or not really old hardware, but old, like, especially audio devices. They always seem to hold up far better than newer ones. just a limb twitching, perhaps. But her eyes were moving as well. Involuntary twitching and rapid eye movements while sleeping can only mean one thing, Max. You just don't want to admit to yourself what it is. If you're about to launch into one of your impassioned speeches about artificial sentience and machines with souls, don't bother. I've heard enough of them by now. Hell, I can write them down from memory. But we can't just ignore the question. If a synth can dream, why can't it have a soul? And if a synth Your first mistake is assuming a soul is a thing. a living person by every standard we can measure. Of course it is far more comfortable to think of them as machines, so we can do what we want with them. If you disapprove of the work we do here, Dr. Benet, we know where to find the teleport. Now just a moment, I never said that. I'm simply trying to open everyone's eyes to new possibilities. Well... It's an unwanted distraction. Turn off the We're men monitor? of science, not philosophers. You do well to remember that. The synths Wait. are treating you well. What I did I just miss? Division are important. But I tend to think of robotics. We received a work order from SRV. What do they need? They're requesting replacement coursers again. Quite a few, actually. I guess they lost a whole unit on the surface. Is this some sort of joke? This is the third time this month. Dr. Ayo can't keep using my synth so recklessly. I refuse to give him any more. Should I tell him that? No, I'll have it. I wouldn't wish dealing with that man on my worst enemy. going on here? I missed this process. Whoa. Wow. No wonder they can pass as humans. That's crazy. Good day. Doctor? You've arrived at a momentous time. Our third generation synths are a true breakthrough. The culmination of centuries of research. It's no exaggeration to say that they're superior in almost every way to human beings. No robot is superior to me. You might not think so now, but just wait. You've only seen a fraction of what our synths can do. Their potential is limitless, like I said. A momentous time. Hi, Doc. Ah, it's you. You're finally with us. I'd just like to apologize for any trouble our synths may have caused for you on your way here. They, of course, couldn't be told of your identity. And they have very specific protocols for protecting themselves and institute interests. Fair enough. Most of which I designed myself. Uh, not to make problems for you, though. I, uh... Will you be staying with us, then? What's it to you? Oh, forgive me. I, I realize... Well, I understand that's somewhat personal. It would just mean a great deal to Sean. If you require anything, especially as it pertains to synths, please let me know. Welcome to the Hi there. Okay, fair enough. Oh. <laughs> With our third generation since, we've improved upon humanity. Uh, not quite. B 
Bioscience. If you encounter a hazardous chemical spill, please alert the facilities division immediately. Noted. Greetings. As the Institute's requisition vendor, I can provide supplies for your missions on the surface. How may I assist you today? Huh. Very good. Let's see what you have. Clean room suit. Don't really care about the uh, things. Institute division head coat. Eh, screw. Hmm. So, really, huh, wow, they are expensive, and that's not even upgraded, whoo, whoo, I'm stupidly going to buy these. <sighs> I can't afford that. That's not going to happen. Well, that's... Mm. Fine. I'm going to regret this. So, head coat. First of all, lab coat. Looks like a lab coat. Head coat. Slightly disappointed. Black Institute lab coat. What? Not quite. Liar. Okay. So. What have I got here for options? Lab coat and that take up everything. So does that and that. Uh, okay. Raiders leather synth 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 and this hmm Welcome. interesting do you require additional supplies uh okay making the executive decision to quick save whoops sure I didn't mean to pull a Let's gun on a you. I think you're a robot and you don't really care. I'm probably going to end up quick saving out of this one. Just, just want to make that known. Yeah, I don't like that helmet. I want the full helmet. I want the ones that the actual synth guards are wearing. That's what I want. Other than that, acceptable. Although, while I'm in here, I'm going to stick to my Courser uniform. Now, if you don't mind, Bioscience. Where do I actually get the, uh, the guard ones? Like the guard's helmet. I'm sure some of this stuff can even probably just be found around in here. Plus, I'm going to have to do a bunch of upgrading on them. You know, the usual. Okay, so this is a storage room. Oh, there's a door back here. I don't even know where I'm at now. Oh. I highly yes. doubt it has a rusty door. But, you know, hey, whatever. Powered microscope, high powered microscope. Oh. Oh. Uh, crystal, fiber optics, gear, and glass. Yeah. Just in general. Aluminum, fiber optics, yeah, screw that. That can go away, I don't really care. Mine, probably should have stored that. So, cauterizer has nuclear material. Really? Ah. <sighs> I need leather, but that's just too much. That was way too much. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, 
fine. You can have your microscope back. Really? Nice. What? Where did I just take myself? Whoa. Now it is like Fallout. Not Fallout. Sweet. Portal. I'm into an old section of the facility that looks way different. Way older. I'm tempted to take that fan. But I can't really afford the weight. Whoa! Rude! Oh god. Why is this section of the facility on lockdown? What's going on here? See, those just hold circuitry. I'm not too worried about that. What? I heard noises. Oh, come on. Assault bot. Wait, those are an old model, are they not? It's coming. Scanners detecting sentient life. Alert level. Uh. Whew. I spent way too long deliberating on that. Duct tape. What? Puncturing pipe wrench mod? Eh. Oh, wait, is that the first time I've actually seen mod, like, directly as loot? Huh. I have a feeling I'm not supposed to be in here. But I saw nothing that told me I wasn't allowed to break in. Hmm. Glue. Adhesive. I seem to have gotten drastically sidetracked. Got it. Bottle cat. But there's a coarser uniform. Baseball cap. Medicine. Some of this technology in here doesn't seem so new. Well, there's stuff in here that's. What? Why is there dead cats? I'll give them the benefit of the doubt and claim it's the synths, but they're in baskets. What? Whoa. So many locked doors. I realized animal experience. A super mutant. Cat. What? Okay, I tried to disarm it. Wasn't landing me. What's going on in here? No. No. Sweet. 
Okay. Deactivate. Where's I have to open it with this. What's going on? What? Oh. Why is there super mutants? They were doing experimentation on making super mutants. Oh, this is where I need to go for Virgil. Okay. Fair enough. Uh-huh. Dr. Holdren's Synth Gorilla Project is showing promising results. Hmm. Fair enough. Plants, huh? Are you actually growing the plants, or are they synthetic Dr. plants, Watson too? Dr. Watson doesn't think I'm institute material. I'm gonna prove him wrong. Hey there. Liam's been trying to teach me robotics. It's more complicated than I thought. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Don't really see anything interesting in there. You. It's great to have you here. Hi, Doc. Welcome. So good to have you here. Dr. Clayton Holdren, head of the Bioscience Division. I can't wait for you to see the work we're doing. It's truly amazing. What work? What? I was just about to explain that. As the name implies, the Bioscience Division specializes in fields of study such as botany, genetics, and medicine. Our most important directive is to ensure the health and well-being of everyone in the Institute. Mm -hmm. To that end, we cultivate highly specialized breeds of flora for use in food and medicine. Okay. We've even started to explore the idea of synthetic animal life. You probably saw the gorillas. They're really just a pet project at this point, but the potential is exciting nonetheless. Hmm. The gorillas are synths too? They are indeed. Judging by your reaction, we've done a good job making them seem lifelike. The initiative is still in its early stages, but the prospects are very exciting. I'm sure I've taken up enough of your time as it is, but I have to ask, have you decided whether you'll join us? Uh, would I fit in? I'm an outsider. Would there even be a place for me here? Even if science isn't your passion, there are plenty of ways to contribute. Our projects sometimes require an agent who can work ah, on the surface see? to observe and gather this... information. Yeah. From what I've heard, you are both fearless and resourceful. I think you'd be ideal for that kind of role. Hmm, thank In you for your case, support, sir. I imagine you'll want to continue looking around. Or, if you prefer, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. Hmm. Medical care? You mentioned medical care? I might need that from time to time. In that case, you'll want to introduce yourself to Dr. Dean Volkert. He's our top biologist and also serves as the Institute's resident physician. Dr. Volkert works in the infirmary. Just pay him a visit whenever you need to. You won't find better medical care anywhere else in the Commonwealth. I'll promise you that. I believe that. Hey, Clayton. I wasn't done with you yet. Something I can do for you? Uh, what Is about there help? anything I can do to help out? There might be. Tell you what, you get settled in and check back with me later. I'll see what I can find out. Okay. I'm sorry, but I'm too preoccupied for chit chat. Fine. Jerk! I'm leaving. Rosalind is as smart as she is beautiful. By leaving, I just mean this area. Wish you had time could examine notice. I need to stop pulling out my shotgun on everything in here. The only time I've been attacked in here is whenever I went somewhere that I really probably shouldn't have. Reporting status. All functions normal. Is it true Food Supplement 77 has been discontinued? That is correct. That was my favorite one. Can't we keep it a little longer? I will be happy to forward your request to the Bioscience Division. In the meantime, 
Please feel free to enjoy one of our other nutritious and flavorful food supplements. I want Supplement 77. I am sorry, sir. People but on the surface have got it pretty no bad. Available. Makes Use me think this for being down here. The commissary is always open. Would you like some <laughs> processed sustenance packets? 